Hi, I'm Elaine Pauley, president of MagnaWave, and I am going to present with you PEMF analog versus digital for dummies. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about what is the difference between analog, aka a spark chamber device, PMF device, and digital PMF device. So a analog PMF device has a big spark chamber inside of it. This is the original way that we made PEMF or created the pulsed electromagnetic fields, okay? And it looks similar to a bomb. So think about that when you're going through the airport next time, okay? So that's why traveling with analog is, is, can be a little difficult. But in there, there's two pins, and the electricity goes in between those two pins. And as those two pins spread out, it changes the frequency. And as they get closer, it changes the frequency and changes the strength. So in there, it's just a very sharp explosion, a very um, hot explosion. That signal then goes down the coils, the copper wiring in the coils, and then creates that magnetic field in the circle of the machine. That's the original way that we made PMF. Now, the uh, analog devices, aka spark chamber devices, are a little bit sharper of a signal. So that signal is a little bit sharper. It's, um, you feel it a little bit more even on the lower settings. So that's not necessarily a good or a bad thing. It's just the way that the signal is delivered. Now, a digital device is actually a computer chip. It's an actual computer chip that creates that same electrical pulse, very similar electrical pulse, that goes down the coils and creates that magnetic field inside the circle. So you, scientifically, and every research that we've done, um, the results are the same. It's the feeling that's different, um, and that's it, mostly. Other than, again, this is for dummies. This is the analog versus digital PMF machine for dummies. Analog machines require maintenance. They usually need those pins inside that spark chamber need to be recalibrated. Um, but they are, they feel stronger. They, there are people who prefer analog. Digital machines don't have any required maintenance from MagnaWave. Uh, we don't require maintenance on them. Sometimes they may need maintenance, just like your computer or your phone or whatever. But in terms of like needed maintenance and parts wearing out, you're going to have much less of that with a digital device. So that's really the difference between the two devices. Um, if you travel a lot, like I said, and you maybe live overseas from the United States, I would 100% recommend digital. It's lighter weight, it's awesome. If you are somebody who really wants to pack a punch and has have used a spark chamber device in the past, then try the spark chamber. Uh, but I think really it's about what you tried first. It's not much in terms of scientific results, there's not much difference.